story out of the East Bay where the driver of a car who led police on a chase across the Bay Bridge is behind bars this morning, but not before crashing his car into the Berkeley Aquatic Park. So the chase started in the city, went over the bridge, and again ended with that driver just basically dropping his car into the drink. Car on 4's Will Tran live in Berkeley this morning with the latest on uh, what's going on out there. And when we talked to you last, Will, they were just pulling that SUV out of the water. That's right. It's right behind me and new information that passed along. We have learned that it is a brand new Range Rover. Even the detectives are telling me it's possibly over $100,000. Why it ended up or how it ended up in the water, that's still under investigation, whether the driver purposely did it or if he lost control. But they have arrested that person. You can see it's now on a flatbed. They started attaching all of the chains to the Range Rover. It's a Range Rover. They started attaching the chains to the Range Rover at around 4.35 in the morning, and they pulled it up. Once they got it on shore, they went through really quickly the inside of the Range Rover just to make sure if there wasn't somebody else inside at the time. It turns out it's an empty car, brand new, paper plate still. They're going to see if this was recently bought or if, in fact, it was stolen. The San Francisco Police Department, they don't uh, have any information on the driver at this time. As you can see, it's ready to be hauled away, and the dive team members, they came out here, secure the area for a few hours and now it looks like they're going to wrap it up and then probably even before they wrap it up they probably will look around the grounds just to make sure everything is uh, covered and, and everything is uh, as far as crossing the T's and dot the I's everything is done and then they'll leave this place you can see it right there everybody's just just marveled by how beautiful that car is the car that went into the water back to you James yeah no kidding and you say the driver was taken to the hospital expected to be all right and I assume will be arrested or at least questioned at some point later this morning yeah, absolutely. The San Francisco uh, Police Department, they took the man out of the water. They took him away. And that was around 1030 last night. And, you know, they were worried about possibly there was somebody else in the car at the time trapped. And obviously, after a few minutes, that person would have been dead anyways. But yeah. they couldn't tell once the divers went into the water. They couldn't tell because it was too dark. So they had to feel everything right in front of their faces. It was only, it was not until they were able to pull the water, the, excuse me, the Range Rover onto the shore, open up the doors look inside. That's when they could conclusively say there was no one else inside, James. All right, very good. Any word why they've got that car in the foreground there wrapped up in police tape? It was, was that a vehicle that was just there when they arrived? I'm trying to find out myself. The information is very hard out here. The Alameda County Sheriff's Department, you can see those divers out there. They are not part of the investigation. They were the ones who were called to come out here, get in the water, pull out the Range Rover. So they were, they were not privy to any information as far as the investigation. As far as the San Francisco Police Department, you can see that officer out there, the one that's not wearing the green jacket. He just walked around the corner there. He's uh, basically in charge of the scene here, but uh, it's very difficult to get information from him. As, as, uh, as to how the driver got into the water. Hmm. And, I mean, obviously, this is right here. I was curious as well why that car is right there and it's covered with uh, police tape. Hopefully, he'll loosen up a little bit, give me a little bit more information. So as soon as I find out, I'll let you know, James. All right, very good. Will, thank you much. Again, reporting live out of Berkeley this morning. Darius.